About 11 years ago, I uploaded my first YouTube video ever. I'll play a little clip of it now. Come back, you dog. Sit. Stay. Woohoo! I love surfing off a car. It was also a Lego video. Lego has been my whole legacy. My license plate is Lego Master. But now, a new chapter begins as my childhood slowly disappears. Lego City is all packed up. It got really dirty over time because it wasn't getting used. So I figured I'd clean everything up, box it up, and open up again someday far in the future when I have my own house with a dust-free environment to set it up in. I will now roll all the clips involved in cleaning up Lego City. Look how nasty this stuff is. I'm done with the first step, got rid of the road plates as well as everything that connects them. I'm gonna wash those now. I forgot to time lapse the next step. This is what I just did. I had no idea I had so many of these, but they were everywhere. Alright, that was every single land vehicle LEGO City has. Here they all are. That's a huge heap of them. Uh, I have to figure out a way to clean them first before I do anything with them, so I'm just trying to get them off the table so I can clean the table. Next up comes the air vehicles and the trains and the boats. Gotta find a big box for those. Alright, boats and planes and helicopters and other things have been put away. This is actually a full-size box and I cut it up to make it sort of like that box. Pretty cool. Just did some quick vacuuming. Uh, I'm gonna save the buildings for tomorrow. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna do to clean them off. Can't wash them like everything else. But anyways, I'm gonna fill in the gaps, move all the buildings closer so I can put those two boxes on the table as well. Get it off my bed so I have a place to sleep tonight. Hopefully the air will clear up before I go to bed so I won't have to wear this. All right, the buildings are finally all packaged up. Didn't do a time lapse of that either. Oh well. Got most of a box here and then a partial box here with all the base plates. You can see on the table an outline of where the buildings used to be. Other than that, the dust will settle. After this, I'm gonna throw the lids on these for now. I'm not sure how I'm gonna clean the cars yet. They're too small to be vacuumed off like the buildings. So those will probably just sit here for a while. And I gotta wash all the train checks and all this other small stuff. These are all stickers, so I can't wash those. And I got these storage units for that. Then I'll vacuum off the table and basically dust everything in my room before most, more dust uh, develops. But yeah, that's it for now.
Okay, the table is completely cleared off. Gonna vacuum it and do my thumbnail for this video. Like I said earlier, you can distinctly see even the train tracks, where the train tracks used to be, but also where the buildings used to be. Pretty easy. So yeah, Lego City is done. This is my 200th vlog. I was hoping it would be something spectacular. And although it is significant, vlogs will continue. Unlike most YouTubers, when they have something troublesome happen in their life. But I'll keep going. A new chapter begins. I graduate college in a few months, and who knows where I'm going to go from there. Thank you all for your love and support, and let's continue the vlog. As I was just driving through town, I felt like I was on a TV show. First off, the moon was huge and very low on the horizon. Second off, three young women who are probably models crossed in front of me on two separate crosswalks. And third, a ambulance covered in Christmas lights on the way to emergency whizzes through the traffic circle. What a night. It's another old movie mistake. The shadow of the rack is still there with the voice mechanism. <laughs> First step of Christmas decorating complete. There you are. That is kind of terrifying. <laughs> I'm back at the Vex Robotics. Got my 2013-2014 shirt on. Gonna be running this bad boy today. So for many, many years, we had this muddy, smelly chicken pen and customers hated it because it was smelly and wet and disgusting. So we put this massive roof over it um, two years ago, maybe. But anyways, now that the ground's all frozen, we just had a huge rainstorm. It's flooded again. That's the rooster. One of them, I think. Here's the other one. But yeah, I could smell it all the way from the side yard. It's pretty bad. Blech. 